the biggest difference between what I've seen here today and what we'd normally see back in Ireland is we probably wouldn't populate an apiary with so many hives. Normally in an apiary in Ireland we normally go to eight maximum and also these are Langstroth and we normally use British Standard Nationals. So a British Standard National is probably about two thirds of the normal size of a brood box. Um, the supers are probably about the same depth, but the brood boxes would be two thirds of the size. Uh, we either put a, a feeder, like an Ashforth Miller feeder on the top. Okay, yeah. Or a little rapid feeder. Okay. We don't do central feeding like... Don't do open no. feeding, okay. Not yet. Not yet, okay. Do you think that the Irish beekeeping community would be open to that, or do you think it would be more controversial? The beekeepers I spoke to, when I spoke to David about open feeding and everything else, I went back and said, well, they use open feeding and everything else. And they were saying, oh, they think it encourages robbing. But then I talked to David, and David talks to me about the natural foraging of the bees and everything else. It com yeah. makes complete sense. Yeah, and robbing, you know, robbing or interacting at an open feeder versus robbing out a hive. dead out yeah, which yeah, yeah, could yeah. be full of brood disease or or full of whatever killed that hive yeah. right so it's attracting them to a central feed source as opposed to encouraging them to go and visit their dead out neighbors we have um centralized water feeders yep for mm -hmm. the bees so why not why Put not sugar syrup in there as well exactly yep. yeah that's awesome